What a lovely surprise rest day with a super fun and mega interesting couple. Amazing. Uh, now I'm back off up into the mountains, but first I have some shoes to buy. Shalom. <laughs> True story, this is my first time inside a decathlon, I think. Apparently these are all okay for cycling and running. I do want to do a bit of running next time I'm not cycling. I have Belinda on PayPal to thank for new shoes. Thank you so much, Belinda. Because these are on sale, I have enough left over for a sports bra. Nice. And matching my penny is, it's just a happy coincidence. New shoes, clean clothes, it feels like a good day. made a new amazing snack discovery. These are sort of salty crisps filled with chocolate. I love them. I don't know how to describe them. They're like Wheaties, but filled with chocolate. So they're sort of like fatty crisp on the outside, sweet chocolate on the inside, my dream come true. These cave tombs had stone doors which moved on metal hinges. inscription on this one it can still be read apparently there's uh, inscriptions in a few languages including arabic it doesn't say which language this one's in yes this was the original stone door wow This one's fallen in. 
Wow. This is where I was before. This is the really extensive one, but this one has been built practically on top of it. Before the gate shut, I managed to get in for a quick run up to the view, but sadly too late to see the monastery. But on the way, I'd spotted one of Israel's lovely free camps for which I only needed to backtrack one kilometer. Nice, this is me for the night. The road's over there, there's a few picnic benches. There's a little bit of litter, not too bad here. I'll have a little tidy up. But despite the litter, these free campsites are one of the best things about bicycle touring in Israel, I think. Inspired by Masha and Pasha and all the veggies they fed me, I'm being very healthy today um, and my reward is chocolate. What is that growling in the bushes? I don't know what that growling sound is, but I'm going to gather some rocks in case I need to throw some projectiles in the night. <laughs> Firefly. Oh, that's scary. <laughs> <laughs> 